Okay, Amber Button here um, from Amber Button Design doing a quick video while wow. little angel sleeping over there. Hopefully he'll stay asleep for the video. Um, I just want to do a quick video on my journals. I'm loving the new Jean Davenport line, of course. <laughs> um, this is the Butterfly Effect book and it was a plain canvas. I painted mine. I still think I'm going to put a character on it, but I haven't decided yet so right now it's kind of abstract I used um, golden acrylics as well as jeans um, and it's got the little little charm there so inside it's they're connected by these um, rubber bands that you buy with that charm I just showed you so it's all kind of connected with signatures so here's the front this is one of her um, free lessons one of Jane's lessons from the mixed media group um, it's a free workshop it's amazing. Um, this was done with mermaid markers and pens, and I actually did this just with her supplies, and I did it sitting um, with it on my lap um, in a hailstorm <laughs> in the car. So um, her supplies are easy to travel with, obviously, and work with. Um, this was done just with um, a Stabilo Marksol pencil and water, and this was um, part of Expression Faces um, Thing from Dana Wakely. So here's some of the little pockets I bought uh, from Jane Davenport to go in here. And I, right now, because I was on the go, I have a pencil in here and an eraser and some little words. Um, you know, you'll see in one of my pictures, I have these little words. I just cut them out of books and saved them for later. Um, this is the basic stencil from Jane. I use it to make swatches. It's perfect for swatches. And obviously circles and squares. Um, the other side of that pocket is my coupons. <laughs> I make this uh, book work for me. It has coupons in it, so I just stick my, my money in it, you know, whatever I need. Here's one page where um, my daughter's been watching Trolls like crazy, so it's got the lyrics to that song, uh, I Will Get Back Up Again, and I love the lyrics. So I used a washi tape here from Jane of the Eyes, and then um, the black fountain pen and a mermaid marker in Jellyfish, and activated it with water. Here is, I never knew what these were when I first saw them. I couldn't figure it out. It's washi tape holders. Now, they're two-sided, so they fit in her book, um, like everything else. But you wind your washi tape on here so that you have it ready in this book and you don't have to carry the rolls around, which is awesome. Um, the less bulk, the more you can do things. And I love these tapes. I wasn't set on them in the beginning, but um, I saw how people used them and was completely inspired. And my friend B Vicky got them from California for me because I couldn't find them. Gorgeous. Thank you, Vicky. Um, this is actually, I made this last week. It's, um, I've been using Peerless Watercolors Jane Davenport set for about a year, I think. And um, I moved all my pieces. You, they come in this cards, these two by two cards, and I cut them in fourths had them on this big sheet and I moved them onto the watercolor paper I bought for the butterfly book um, so that it would fit in here. Look, it fits absolutely perfectly. So I actually have watercolors in the book so I can just put a pencil in the book and I have everything. Um, and then I bought these uh, report covers from Target and um, cut them to size and stapled them on. I wish I had watched James's video about how to do staples yourself, but I did it wonky. Um, so you, yeah, I've got swatches on these and you just add a water brush and then, um, this can be used to hold washi tape pieces. Like if I grab an eye off here that I don't want yet, it can be used as a palette also. Um, and so I did it front and back of both sides. Here's the rest. Um, here's a quick little page I did to test out the washi. On this one, it's harder to tell. I used washi for the eye and on this one, it's obviously very obvious on purpose. Okay, this is a sketch I obviously haven't completed yet. Here's another pocket. I thought about finishing her. That'd be cool. Here's some rub-ons I have in here with a little popsicle stick. The pockets are so handy. Other side of the pocket. These are the tapes at the end that aren't sticky. Don't waste those. You glue them down. <laughs> um, here's the other half with that. The Peerless watercolors. And here's the other half of the washi with the smaller face pieces. And this is the start of that insert that came with the book. I don't even know what kind of paper it is, cardstock. But, oh my gosh, it is so much better than cardstock. It actually takes water and paint. This I just did with pen last night. And I was listening to a um, 
Florence and Machine song inspired me, and this is Mermaid Marker. Obviously, it's not as watery on this paper, but it still works really well. And here is where I use those words I was talking about, and I use tape here. It's hard to tell because I actually blended it pretty well. Um, they give you kind of a jumping off point or a way to audition ideas. Like, I never would have done this sassy figure if I had to do the face by hand. Um, and I used um, Jane Davenport's watercolors, um, Prima Decadent Pies watercolors, and Jane Davenport's uh, acrylics, and then the pen, fountain pen. Or actually, I use a sketchy, sketchy, a Sharpie sketch pen. That's what I've been using, actually, because I want permanent uh, marker. And this is just where um, some ink, I dabbed it off and smushed it like a butterfly. Never waste leftover paint or ink. So here's this book. I need another one. I don't even know if you can buy it separate, but I really like it. It's where the signature attaches. Okay, here's some more washi tape. Here's the floral stencil. I'm not big into florals, so I'm not sure if I'll use it, but might as well have it in here. I printed out those calendar inserts that Jane gives away in the workshop. And they've worked really well. Like, I never schedule anything. I schedule our menu, like our food. You can see what we're having for dinner every night last week, but... I never schedule anything. I'm so bad. And since I can make it pretty, I'm actually doing it. Which is nice. <laughs> Here's this week's. And I just added some watercolor, like in two seconds. So on the phone making doctor's appointments. And did the watercolor really quickly. Um, so it's going to keep me organized. Yay, thank you, Jane. Um, here's the end of the flower stencil. And that's it. And this whole thing has, I'm doing this one-handed, but it has this tie. So no matter how big... Although I'm going to need more eventually. Um, it hooks in. So that's my butter, butterfly effect journal. You can see I'm using Jane's Beautiful Faces book. Um, but I absolutely love it. And um, can't wait to put more in it. To draw more in it. And to get more. Thanks. Have a great day guys.